and I'm down in the school room again. Um, New Year's Day was yesterday and we had a nice rest and today I'm back down on it again uh, sorting out baskets um, preparing for Monday. Um, so I thought I'd just show you Mary's basket and um, let you have a look at each thing that we do for um, our subjects and give it a bit of a tidy. So yeah. Okay, so it's time to sort out Mary's basket. And I'll just quickly show you her journal um, as we go through and look at all the stuff and have a little sort out. Um, this is her journal that she started doing in September. I found these online um, and you can get them on Amazon. Um, they're called the Thinking Tree Publishing Company, you can see there. Um, and basically I, I was so pleased when I found them because they're just such, such fun and there's so much in here that you can use um, for different things um, and uh, a really good fill-in as well if you're helping your other other child and and they're waiting for you to help them um, it's really cool there's all sorts in here um, it's very much library based as well um, using library books and um, yeah, so I will show you in more detail um, this at some point. Uh, yeah, it's so cool. Reading time, colour me, all sorts of things. Yep, so that's her journal. And she's the, you can get all different ages of these journals. Um, so she's got ages 6 to 9. And uh, for dyslexia as well, they're really good. They've got... Dyslexic font, I think, um, if you have a child with that. Um, yeah, so next thing. Okay, so this is her reading comprehension. Um, so she has this book that she reads to me. Um, uh, most days, it's really cool. It's got lots of interesting stories in. And with that comes this workbook that she does um, based on the stories and it's got some phonics in there as well. So that's for her reading comprehension. So I'll put that in front of here. Um, try and do all the English ones first to show you. And then what else has she got? Now, this is a really cool one I found an American uh, course called Essentials in Writing and I will review this at another point but this is what she does she watches a little video and then does uh, one, one or two pages a day so that's her grammar book uh, put that in the basket and what else have we got um, spelling Spelling. Right, so this is our temporary spelling curriculum that we're doing till I save up for the one that I really want to get. Um, called Spelling Power. I used this with my older boys uh, for a number of years and it worked really well. Um, so they've got different levels of spelling. Basically it's just reading out the words to them. And then the ones they don't know, they turn over and do on the other side and practice them. And they have a little test at the end. Um, so that's quite cool. I chose to not have a book, but just use a whiteboard uh, pen for this. Um, so they enjoy doing that. Um, for maths, we have a book called... Um, what about... The Life of Fred, which is really good. Um, again, I'll go into more detail about this book. Um, so basically, it's a chapter she does, and then I printed this off the internet. So for each chapter, you have a little uh, space to do the answers here. So that's for her maths. She does one chapter a day of that one. And then for times tables, I found a really good thing called Times Tales, which we've been using. Um, and uh, it's basically all the hard tables that uh, uh, children find hard to learn 
and she's been doing it's a story basically they learn a story and, and learn the answer through a story um, and this has been really helpful for her to learn these tables um, again I'll, I'll give more information about that um, so that's been really cool so I've got all the bits out of her basket now um, just beginning to look a bit more tidy um, Let's get the English at the front. Right, so looking a bit better. This is a, a little project we've been doing um, uh, on Little House on the Prairie, which I, I found in um, online. Uh, from Teachers Pay Teachers, I think, the website. Uh, we've been reading Little House on the Prairie, um, which Mary really likes. And it's a little project that I bought. Um, so we've been doing that. So that's a history, history that, a little bit of history we've been doing. So as you can see, it's looking a bit tidier now. Um, getting a bit sorted out. Um, you probably didn't notice any science in her basket. That's because I'm currently sorting a curriculum out for her. That's one basket done, now I've got three more to do. Um, and as you can see, it's getting dark outside. I need to go make some tea. Um, I don't even know what I'm gonna have yet. So um, I will see you soon. And next time I will go into more detail some of those uh, uh, curriculums that we looked at. Um, in Mary's basket and show you more in detail um, about what I like about them and why I chose them. Okay, see you soon. Bye!